I just hit 100 followers on Twitter. So naturally, I'm calling my plastic surgeon. Doctor? Oh, oh, ah. you're back. Ah. You're back. Yes. Ah. It is I, your dastardly doctor, here for your plastic surgery consultation. My name is Dr. Fumagali Kavorkian. So basically what I want is just like kind of a, just like a revamp. I watch a lot of reality TV and they all look pretty great. Can Everyone on TV looks great. By the time you hit like season two or three, yeah, everybody starts to look really great. I guess I'm looking for my second season. I went real viral. I have over a hundred Twitter followers. So, you know, with my newfound, uh, I, I, I don't want to say fame, but I guess, <laughs> I guess we'll say fame. Your words. Yeah. Also mine, fame. <laughs> good, Karen. Good. Good. Wow. Let's get you a famous face then. I see your lips and they are looking rather flat. Uh, Blow those out. We, uh, you, we have a special procedure in which we will take your eyes and we really make them pop. Oh, I've heard you could do a, a scalp uh, transplant. Yes, we will do a scalp transfer, lip in beginning, eyes popping, what about my chin? Your chin looks non-existent. We will give you a chin to make you season two beautiful. Do you have a lot of experience with arms? It is my belief that everyone in this country has the right to bear arms. Oh, I love that. Oh, doctor. Oh, you are speaking my language. I don't want anyone to know. It's not going to look too obvious, is it? No, never. No one will. It, it's gentle touch-ups. Because I don't want to be one of those ladies with the fish lips. Never. Never fish. No. This is real people lips. Yeah. I'm really going to own the libs with my new look. <laughs> own the libs? with your new lips. Oh, I love that. Oh, I <laughs> love it. Uh, put it on a t-shirt. Oh, please do. Do we get you into the surgery room now? Oh, right now? You don't schedule an appointment. You just go right to it, huh? Yep. Okay. Yes, I we do. We come straight to you. Oh, Drive wow. by service. That really works for my schedule. Uh, Douglas gets home at about five. So if we could be done by then, because he'll, he'll, he'll expect dinner. We will drive by in the van, the same van in which I got my medical degree, and then we'll prepare you inside. I did find you on Facebook, so oh, I trust Transparency is important in the medical field. I agree. And discretion is key here at Kevorkian Industries. We would like it if it was discreet on both sides. Oh, so I when that. you Venmo us, just send us a picture of an apple. Well, all right. Uh, I guess just come on over and I'll hop in your van and we'll get started. Okay. See you in a minute. All right. Great. Are you the nurse? Nurse Cat? <laughs>